1992 Nissan 240SX, automatic, clean title, 138,000 miles, clean interior, car does not run for some reason. This is all in the title. It's now down to $5,000. Lost interest in it. I'm asking 10,000 OBO, seen worst, for a higher price. DM me for more information. Keep your negative comments to yourself. Thank you. Now, the first thing I'm noticing here, honestly, is that this bumper has never been drilled for the front plate. Yeah, that's pretty based. That's, you never ever see this so that's kind of cool it doesn't look like it's in that bad condition and honestly for five thousand bucks i mean i'd want to see more but you know it doesn't look bad uncracked dash and it, it has that it has the there in the in the passenger footwell oh yeah there is something interesting in the footwell what what do we have here there's a baby <laughs> <laughs> oh my god it's this is haunted this is like Just, that's a doll like, you, know right? how, you know how like when girls get a bunch of a with her he gets haunted. Oh my god. Ramen says footwell fetus. <laughs> <laughs> my wife just walked in and said, What are you looking at? Somebody <laughs> told <laughs> <laughs> Well, ask her, does she think this is a doll or a real baby? It's a doll, dude. It's a doll. Look, do you think that's a doll or a real baby? That's a doll. Yeah, all right. It's a doll. All right, all right, all right. Oh yeah. As somebody it's a real who's... it's a real doll though, you know what I mean? Like the, <laughs> oh, yeah, the realistic yeah, yeah, yeah. ones. Mm-hmm. As someone who has personally met Neckier, yes, he has a wife, although he does her voice very well. He doesn't have a wife and he doesn't have a Baja. <laughs> the Baja is shorter than I thought, but I mean, he's just tall next to it. So none it, of this is real. <laughs> <laughs> you so, need to wake up. You need to wake up from the coma. We need you back. You can't keep looking at Nissan 240SX on Facebook Marketplace. You have CCF to come back. CCF is just your coping mechanism. You need to come back to reality. Stay asleep. No filter on the cold air intake. He's got a can of starting fluid right there. He can't get this running. It's clean for five grand at the end of the day. Wake for up, Jeff. <laughs> Damn, Jeff is freaking out. Jeff, you need to wake up. <laughs> Michael, quit smoking weed. David, just go to sleep. It's like 3 a.m. Jeremy, your parents love you. Go home. Your name's Michael, and you'll. N <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> this looks like a pretty good deal for five thousand bucks, and maybe we've just looked at too many of these. But for five thousand, it's not bad. For ten thousand, he's out his fucking mind, and that's why it's sad for thirteen weeks. Yeah, and it's still sitting. Apparently, go buy it. He'll take thirty five hundred. You'll get a steal at thirty five hundred. If, if you put thirty five hundred bucks in this fucking dude's hand, money talks and boy walks dude and honestly the seats are like in great condition yeah i mean th this one's chewed up but what do you expect One hundred thirty-eight thousand miles is not bad either that lens for the dome light you can get oh and somebody put my dome light is out pass me the flashlight the worst thing that i could <laughs> good stuff but the, the worst thing that i see on here <laughs> is whatever happened to the gas door like yeah like was there a fire there what is this how does that happen? We saw something the yeah, other we week. Saw that that. We saw that on one the other day. We're like, why is it going that way? Yeah, so weird. I'm glad that's never happened to any car I've owned because it's just such an odd, hideous, cartoonish thing. Like it looks like syphilis. Yeah. So for some, so the, the, the seatbelt buckle is off for some reason. And he cut, it looks like he cut the wire because I don't look like, it doesn't look like there's a plug there. What an odd thing to do. Very. Well, maybe he took the seat out because he was dicking around underneath the dashboard or something, but why would you take out the, the buckle? I think that's completely yeah. separate. Unless he was so retarded that he took out, he took out the seat, saw it was connected by a wire and unbolted the f <laughs> <laughs> The buckle. Maybe. Well, he gave up, man. He's he's not interested anymore. He lost interest. I think it looks pretty nice. It's not. It's honestly not bad. I mean, other than the baby, it does look pretty clean. The baby is terrifying, but other than that... I have genuinely been considering getting one, but like, as you guys know, the prices are just fucking... Wild. The cost of entry is is ridiculous, which is why we talked about the other day how someone was saying that they saw a nice 240 and like were afraid to talk to the old man. You have to, you, you know, we, we, we have to go back to the old ways of, of knocking on doors and asking people, <coughs> excuse me, because that's how we're going to get the cars now, you know, and it's really yeah, outside mean... of... It's outside of the comfort zone of a lot of young people interacting with people face to face. But if you want that deal, you have to follow a mother home or to Walmart or wherever they're driving and say, hey, you know, I, you know, I like your car. It's, is it for sale? Would you be interested in selling? And even if it's even if they don't sell it right then and there, you can always say, oh, well, hey, dude, take my number down. You know, and if you ever decide on selling it and maybe you'll get a call in a week, a month, a year. I'm trying to talk some shit. Discord.gg slash feed. Let's talk some shit. Give me your money. Give me your money. Feel her post before I decided to take apart for an LC9 engine swap. 89 Ooh. 240SX OEM two-tone. Car is clean, no rust. Dual cam engine from my old vert. Mileage on engine is about 100,000 miles. 
polyurethane bushings, don't really know what brand coilovers, new tie rods, ball joints, Z32 five lug swap, Z32 brakes. The Speedo doesn't work, it has LED headlights, heat works great, welded the diff myself, and he will consider trades. Why did he cut holes there? That's for a, a cage. God, that, that wing definitely oh, is something. Oh, you right. That wing definitely is something, I'll be honest. That wing's terrible. The paint looks nice. The paint looks really nice. The paint's gorgeous. I love the color. But yeah. it's a tail. It's a f***ing tail as old as time here, you know? If that car would have just never been touched by human hands, yeah. he could easily get he could easily get his asking price. Is it an original two-tone or is it a respray? Because the engine bay is, well, the engine bay is not noium color. It's like. I would say that the, the engine bay has been, blue. been sprayed because that's what the boys like to do. What a weird hey, color I choice. Engine bay. They, they, it's like, a, it's like they, they think, you, you ever watch that show Flea Market Flip? No, but I can, I can picture it in my With head. With Lara Spencer. Oh yeah, Lara Spencer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So people go to the flea market, get sh- they buy shit in the flea market, fix it up, and then go to another flea market and resell it. And they and they it's two teams competing, and we'll say they'll say like, okay, who made the most money? Okay. Who made the most profit? And they'll they'll always be like, oh, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a pop of color. And with shelves, they'll they'll paint the shelf. Let's say they paint it silver, but then when you open it, it's red on the inside. It's a pop of color. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the same thing with this. They're these 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 boys are going for a pop of color, but. The first Supra I owned was a Mark III. It was white, house paint white, but the interior was purple with a ton of glitter and sparkle. Did you do it that? Was, no, okay. I didn't. <laughs> you just bought, I bought it. it you like thought that. it was cool, I bet. I bought it like that for $1,200 because it was a manual non-turbo 7 MG. And you were like, dude, we're going to hit the wangin', dude. I had it for a week, and then the guy I bought it from, because I was making payments, said he needed it for work, and then I never saw it again. But, what? Well, so but you paid twelve hundred dollars for it, and then some I only guy paid took it away from you. I only paid. I only paid six hundred at that point. But as far as I am aware, nowadays uh, he is homeless with a Harley. Oh, tight. So uh, I'd say I won. So some guy took six hundred dollars and then repoed the car from you. Pretty much when I uh, um. So it was one of my friend's friends, and uh, once he did that, everyone cut ties with him. He sold the car to some other guy for like 1500 bucks, and then lost all of his money, lost his wife and kids, and now he's homeless, and apparently he has a Harley Davidson. I don't know, dude. He has a Harley, so <laughs> sounds like he's winning. He's cranking that hog. Yeah. And he do he do be cranking that hog, though. <laughs> Look at the pull. Look at the bacon. Oh, my God. Yeah. Definitely a baseball bat, let's be honest. That looks like shit. Nobody wants to buy your used up car that's ready to settle down now. People <laughs> want virgin cars. No, it's about to get the BBC in this picture. <laughs> God. No, it's an SBC. This is a wild first picture. 89, 240SX, 3,000 bucks, seven weeks ago, Daytona Beach, Florida. Uh, convertible, wide body, comes with what you see in the pics. Won't reply to is this oh available. God. Oh my God. <laughs> Won't reply to is this available. Car starts on starting fluid. The full swap, 1,500 bucks. Needs fuel system hooked up, needs battery, needs paint, needs love. But a quick trip hey, to Mako and rent. Yeah, DM, yeah, DM him real quick and say, and say, uh, Get on CCF. Get on CCF, they roast in you. He's not going to know what CCF is, guys. But a quick trip to Mako and rent a wheel, and you'll have the coolest car that will have all the bros on you. Tired of only talking to girls at car meets? Fear not. It, Some he's boy three-piece wheels and paint? Boom! If you ask stupid questions, you'll get stupid answers. Shoot me offers, trades, etc. Life's life in the f*** out of me and i need to get money into it daily as it turns out owning seven project cars because it's unlikely they all won't run wasn't a good philosophy all right well the guy's saying he was he was too deep into the uh into the nissan he realized life. that he, he realized he f***ed up look at that driveway dude it's wrecked from this guy's life <laughs> it's like it's like the picture of like a an old man's like beaten weathered hands in black and white you know wow. Yeah, yeah. No, it's like a picture of um, like a the tiny girl sitting on the couch, but it's the driveway and then it's surrounded by <laughs> seven piece of shit cars. <laughs> <laughs> you lost my gain or something like that. Auto cars must be newer in four door. And damn it, if collector car feed doesn't let me know and puts me in their video, one of you motherfuckers better tell Netgear he looks like my dad who never came back with the milk and I want stickers to make up for the missed child that can, support. That can never, first off, be proven. Okay, <laughs> I'm not taking a test. Uh huh. And and I don't care. You know, I'm I, you, I, you were I was never I, I was never meant to stay. In that family. Oh, look, he messaged you. I have you. been told. <laughs> <laughs> look at the fucking wide quote unquote. I'm doing Orion air quotes right now. Wide body. Why does it look 
It's homemade. I, as I, fuck. I can't even put into words what it looks like, man. Like this is. They cut it. They cut the fender off and then just widened it and then put like pieces of metal. Is the like, side of that. it mint? Like, is it supposed to look like a weathered airplane coming back from battle? Or is this primer? Like, is what is this? Like, are these like rivets airbrushed onto it? What the? F it's like, ugly. It's. I wish that there were more pictures from the side. What the f did you sand this with, dude? <laughs> <laughs> a, he, a rock? Because tuner culture. And what's in the passenger seat? A refrigerator? A refrigerator fits in a 240SX, but not a Honda Element, I'm meant to believe. <laughs> Dog, look at the f***ing shifter. <laughs> yeah, it has, oh it has that fucking like crooked in it. The, the bent carrot disease. <laughs> Peronis. Is that what it's called? Dude, it's it, called Peronis. You know what the bent disease is called? The, it's the bent carrot <sighs> disease? Look, man, you make a lot of friends in the Air Force, and uh, you learn definitions of new words for isn't conditions that like you've a, never seen. Isn't that seen. like a Jewish pastry? Holy shit, this no. thing's doing 140 miles an hour right now. Oh God. At 9,000 like, RPM. And it's redlined. 9,000 <laughs> RPM. Bro, how did he step out to get that photo? That's wild. I would like a better, like, picture of the side. Yeah. Like, not a, not a filtered... One's filtered, and then one's like a Bigfoot picture. One picture from the back, maybe, too, because the... I mean, we don't even know what this yeah. wide body fucking looks like. Yeah, does the vent go all the way through? Yeah. It's it's bad. It's bad, bad. But in his defense, he's not asking a whole lot. But then again, it's probably worth less. Don't buy this. If you're watching this, and you're going, oh, sh can finally own a 240SX. It only will cost me $3,000. Yeah, this is not the one. Don't f***ing buy this. It's going to cost you another 3000 to even get it close to the road. This car is just for, like, you know, a 240SX Instagram junkyard guy. You know the guys. Like, uh, there's one called 240SX yeah. Mafia. Guys who part these out. That's who this is for. Somebody should buy this for 500 bucks and pull it apart and sell all the pieces. And the parters aren't going to sell it for, aren't, aren't going to buy it, I'm sorry, for three. Absolutely not. There's not $3,000 worth of parts on it. If this was a, a hatch or a coupe, Maybe. For 3000 100% buy it and drift it. But it's not worth drifting a vert. It's not worth owning this. It's just going to be funny. Bad. It's going to be funny going from this to the one that I sent you because they're not polar opposites, but they're far apart. Let's take a look. All right, so here this it is. is one, this is one that me and Acid Runner are, are actively looking at getting. Okay. 91, fresh, 246, 5000 bucks. Fresh knows the owner. Okay. So this is, this is near you guys? Yep. Read the description. It's funny well, as fuck. Why do you both want? Why would you guys want to own it together, like a timeshare? No, no, no. We're both like, we're both like actively looking at it separately. All right, five thousand bucks, ninety-one two forty SX, twenty-nine weeks ago in Round Rock, Texas, hundred twenty thousand miles, RB twenty-five DET S two S thirteen. Edit on January 9th, twenty twenty-four. Piece of sh lost compression. Please take it away before I keep putting money into it. Thinking of going another direction, so it's up for the millionth time. Plenty of parts, full details for serious buyer. 305 wheel horsepower, 270 torque. No, it really should not be your f kid's first car. Unless you hate your kid, no payments. I guess. I guess. No payments. Open the trades, aiming for cash, shoot your shot, worst I can say is no. I'm just upset. I flaked on the swap purchase so I could send him the actual sale post of the swap. LOL. Don't ask me why so many people are willing to pay $2,400 for a KA24DE swap, but last one sold for $1,700 without harness or accessories. Ugh. Yeah, but take that's part it, you know, take the, take the good shit out of it and sell that because that's what'll sell. When you frame <laughs> it like that, no one's going to want it. <laughs> so... No, he sold the Baja. So, dude, um, I did not sell the Baja. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna rate you five stars, dude. But, um, <laughs> real, did you buy it like that? Did you buy it for the purpose of using it as like a parts car or something? Like, why the f do you own this thing? Got it as a roller for dirt cheap a few years ago. Been sitting in the back lot. I build BMWs. Okay, okay. So this is putting fucking star and heart stickers on a BMW does not equate building. Just well, Necker's going to continue <laughs> roasting you, but I'm going to try to be nice. <laughs> so he, did, he didn't ruin the car himself. He didn't do this to it. He actually put an engine in it. He was, he was trying to make it better. He was trying to save an S chassis. Yeah, I mean, I, 
It was it was a, it was a lost cause from the start. All right, so this other one, this one's from Alan, and we have. Um, well, I already started reading it a while ago, but piece of shit lost compression. Take it before it this keep piece of shit lost compression. It. it used to make three hundred five wheel horsepower. He wants he wants some cash and shoot your shot. We're down to five thousand bucks on an RB twenty five DET swapped S thirteen. The body, aside from being obviously ruined with the you know like cut bumpers and shit. Yeah, it has, or, or is, or is that bolt on? It? That's a bash bar, but is, it, is that a is no, that a bolt on? What was the name for the bash bar? We called it something else. Um, was it the f word bar? <laughs> yeah, I think that's right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it has it has the bash bar, cringe bumper, cringe fenders, disgusting yeah, cringe. exhaust. I hate that exhaust. You're so stupid if you run that. Um, this is worth five thousand bucks as a roller, though. It probably is worth five thousand bucks as a roller, in all honesty. And the the weird thing about the bumper, it has like those lines, like like the new Camrys. I think they have those like those the tear goth things fucking, on the yeah, yeah yeah the goth teardrops coming out. Yeah, I see horrible what you said. Fucking tail lights. Oh, the the half clear ones off eBay. Yeah, they just, yeah they look they just look cheap. They do look cheap. I kind of get why people do it, but they they they, they do it I'd to be different. Stock. They do it because it's not what it was stock. It's like. I say, and I say this all the time too. It's like curly hair girls, curly hair girls. Oh, I have to straighten my hair. Straight hair <laughs> girls. Oh, I have to curl my hair because it's well, yeah, not look what like, I have. Look like lowrider culture. It's the same thing. The entire point of it is to make your car as unusable as possible and change something. Yeah. Oh, this is how it was in the factory. I'm gonna put. I'm gonna put something, <laughs> and that makes me cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but yeah. So I mean, Alan, you should buy this. And worst case scenario, you have a five thousand dollar roller. It's been sitting for. Th- 29 weeks there must be something horribly wrong with it yeah uh, i mean i'll message him if i'll say if i can get it for 3500 four grand um, yeah i got a project car sitting a in title. the garage oh yeah that might be important i kind of feel like maybe it doesn't because it's been sitting for half a year jose Contreras says he lives in round rock and he's seen his car in person whole car is cringe i, I believe it yeah i believe it here's the back of oh that my goodness vert oh oh <laughs> 